To get the cheapest FIFA coins on the internet, make sure to go and check out Mule Factory. I've left a link in the description and a discount code as well. You can get 100,000 FIFA coins for just eight pounds. Eight quid. Eight, eight quid for 100,000 FIFA coins. Go and check them out. They're 100% reliable. I've used them so, so much. Make sure to use the code LE5CHEAP at checkout and let's get into the video. In this video, I've got five different players that you can go and snipe in FIFA 20 today to make you about 50k an hour. Honestly, these players are easily the best players to snipe right now in FIFA 20. And if this video gets over 300 likes in the next 24 hours, I'll show you guys five more players that you can go and snipe and make loads and loads of coins. So if you want to see that, drop a like on this video. And I am going to be starting today trading videos every single day for the next week. So if you're hyped about that, subscribe. Just Subscribe, please. Please subscribe and turn notifications on. Christ almighty, please. Oh, what is going on, guys? LA96, and welcome back to a brand new video on my channel. In this video, I'm going to be going through and showing you guys some players who you can go and snipe right now in FIFA 20 who will be making you loads and loads of coins. Honestly, you'll be making about 50,000 coins every single hour using these methods. If you guys enjoy this video, please drop a like on it. If you're new, subscribe, turn notifications on because like I said at the start, we're going to be doing trading videos every single day for the next week. So if you want to see that and you're here for it, subscribe. Follow me on all my socials, there's links in the description, but let's jump straight into this video. First player that we're going to be starting off with is going to be Mustafi. Now, all of these players that I'm going to be showing you guys are all from the Premier League, and they are all players who don't really have too much competition on them. If you want to see different leagues or specific leagues, just let me know down in the comment section. But we are going to be starting off with Mustafi on the PlayStation. So if you're on Xbox or PC, make sure to just find whatever his minimum price is when you guys come to do this. But as you can see, his minimum price right now is around 1.3k and he does actually pop up for minimum price so, so much. And a lot of these players are going to be common gold players because at the minute they are easily the best snipe because basically what's happening right now is because everyone's in because of a certain something and we're all self-isolating blah 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 sick to death of it everyone is basically completing loads of different SBCs, so loads of different cards are now going for a ridiculous ridiculous price they've basically just all gone up because everyone's doing it right now there's so many people playing fifa 20 right now it's absolutely mental views are up everyone's chilling but as you can see right here car pops up for a thousand coins and we've made some coins so then we can sell that one on for 1.3k because that's how much he's going for on the market right now and like i said these are going to be cards who are going to be making you a lot of coins that took me 20 searches i found a card and i've managed to sell it on for 300 coins profit after the five percent ea tax probably going to be making around 200 coins roughly but after 20 searches i'm pretty happy with that I'm pretty happy with that so basically what you need to do is go through with all these players and start to snipe them then once you've done some sniping on them what you're going to do is do some mass bidding on them i'm going to show you guys exactly what you need to do for mass bidding first off you need to find the minimum price of the card so in this example it was 1.3k, but now it's looking like 1.4. Uh, maybe not even 1.4. Brilliant. I think this guy's actually going for like 1.5k. Yeah, 1.5k, probably into selling around 1.4. So what you need to do is basically come over here and then you need to reset all of this and put your max price to whatever it is that you are going to be sniping at. So say, for example, before I was sniping around 1,000-ish coins. Let's say it's 1.1 that we'd be sniping for now because he's going for 1.4k. I'm going to put this max price down 100 coins or however much you want to mass bid at. I'm just going to go for 100 coins because I want to mass bid at 1.1k. Search up on the market and you basically need to see how many cards you can find with a bid not on them at 1.1k. And go through and drop as many bids as you possibly can do at 1.1k or whatever the price is when you guys come to check this. But as you can see, I'm going up to around the 5 minute mark. I've bidded on around 6-ish cards. I may even go the tiniest bit longer actually and bid on a few more of these. And basically what you'll actually find is that you'll start to win a lot of these cards and then once you've got them on your transfer targets you can then sell them on straight away and basically whilst you're waiting for all these cards to come in you can go back over here and start to do even more sniping it's, it's pretty simple really and you're going to be finding this with a lot of these players you're going to actually win quite a few of them on the transfer list and you're also going to be winning quite a few of them on a snipe as well which you're chilling you're chilling if you're in social iso right now this is easily one of the best ways to make coins in FIFA 20. So let's jump into the next player. All right, next up is going to be Doherty. Now, I think that right now, 
a lot of the defenders are actually decent to snipe because a lot of the players that I've got in this are defenders. So we're going to find the minimum price of Doherty right now. Now before when I was sniping, it was around 1.5k, but it's looking like it's now 1.4k that people are selling on for. Let's just take a look to see how many are up at 1.4k. There's only a couple and they are selling at 1.4k. So then I'm going to come through and I'm going to do some sniping at 1,000 coins. Just before I get into the sniping though, I'm going to do the exact same thing as what I was doing before. Max price, I'm going to put it to 950 because I want to be bidding at 1,000 coins. As you can see right here, I'm going to be seeing all those. It looks like there are a couple of people may have actually already dropped bids on these as you can see. A few people trying to go at 950 coins but I'm being one of them people and just mass bidding it even more than that it looks like this guy's actually just going for 950 and all these i don't think you're going to be winning them at 950 but dropped a load of bids there now it's time to come back and start to do some sniping which is exactly what we're going to be doing 1000 coins and let's see if we can see anything i'm hoping that i'll be able to see something pretty soon just to show you guys how active these filters all are and i've even gone through before recording and got loads of deals on all these players which I'll show you guys at the end of this video so make sure to stick around for that to see how many deals I did actually manage to get. We're just going through and sniping and seeing how many cards will actually pop up. I may need to change this price however with all these cards you're going to be getting them for a couple hundred coins under and you may even start to see some at minimum price which means that you could be making around 1,000 coins per card which is absolutely ridiculous and considering how easy these are to get because the common rare gold cards you're going to be laughing. You're absolutely going to be laughing because you're going to be making so much profit with these cards. So let's jump through and try and get ourselves a snipe on this Doherty, just give me two seconds. And there we go, we've managed to get one at 950 coins, which is a very nice deal considering he's going right now at 1.4k, so we can make a decent 400, 500 coins profit on this guy. But just for this video, I want to sell him at 1.3 just to show you guys how quickly these cards will sell on. But as you can see, it really didn't take me too long. Just a couple of searches and we've got all those bids on as well, which I'll be checking at the end of this video. So make sure to stick around for that. But let's jump into this next player. Next up, we're going to be going at four. Johnny. Now, I've actually done a video talking all about this guy in a position modifier video. If you want to go and watch that video, it's a very good trading method which still works. I'll leave a link to it in the description or I'll put it on a card or on the end screen. There'll be ample opportunities to go and check it out. But let's take a look at Johnny on the market right now. As you can see, he is actually going for a quite expensive price and that's the good thing with these common rare gold cards is that they fluctuate so, so much. So say, for example, you come on and you look at Johnny on the market and when you're watching this video, he's going for like 700 coins 800 coins you could go to the next player maybe like doherty and they go up in price so these players fluctuate so much so if you just use these five players that i'm showing you you'll be making a million coins in fifa 20 so so quickly so on the market right now he's insta selling at 1.6k so what i'm actually going to do is do some sniping at 1.3 ish just before that though i do need to take my own advice and jump over to the max price right here set that to 1.1 i'm actually gonna do some bidding at 1.2k on mass bidding i think so let's just go through and drop as many bids as we possibly can do at 1.2 i do actually have some of this guy on my transfer targets already i'll show you guys that in a little bit but we need to go through and get a snipe on this johnny card and like i said this guy is a perfect card to trade with he's in left wing back he pops up so much he's so good for mass bidding he's just a perfect card to trade with in my opinion he's probably one of the best players in this video so i'd highly recommend to go and try out johnny right now just before anybody else does if this video takes off it'll be quite hard to get a few deals on this guy but Hopefully some of you guys will be able to make some decent profit with this guy. So let's go through. Let's try and get a snipe on him. Let's hopefully get a snipe, which is a decent snipe as well. I don't want to be going for something which is 1.2k. Ideally, I want something which is like minimum price so I can show you guys how good this method is by just cycling through these five players that I'm showing you guys. And like I said at the start of this, if you want to see another video of me going through and showing you guys more players to go and trade with and make loads of coins with that no one else has uploaded on YouTube before, make sure to get a like on this video right now and get this video to over 300 likes but we've just missed out at 1000 coins that's absolutely no problem that's going to happen from time to time you're not going to get every single deal on a snipe you're not going to get every single mass bid one there at 900 coins and we just miss out but you can see how active this filter hello Hello. I was trying to say you can see how active this filter is and I've just completely messed up the snipes. I hate trying to talk whilst I'm sniping because every single time I start doing it, I mess it up. 
or something happens. But you guys can see how active this card is. It's absolutely ridiculous. We've seen some for 800 coins, 950 coins. And don't forget, this guy insta sells at 1.6k. So there's so much profit to be had just on this one card. You could even just use this one card in like half an hour and make yourself 10,000, 20,000 coins, depending on how fast that you can get these cards and how lucky you are and there we go we've got one at 1.1k not the best deal we could have got however i can go over here and i can set this to you know what i'll go for 1.5k just so he sells on pretty quickly but please please go and try these methods out go and try the mass bidding go and try the sniping and guess what i've still got two more players so let's jump into it next up is going to be a center back from brighton and it is going to be lewis dunk my namesake. There we go. So let's take a look to see how much he's going for on the market right now. We go over to 1.5k and as you can see, he's going for 1.5k. Is so anything cheaper? There's one thing up at 1.4k which hasn't actually sold on yet. So what I'm actually going to do is do some sniping at 1.1k. And as you can see with all of these cards, they're a pretty similar-ish price. First things first though, we're going to do some bidding on this guy as well. And I'm going to go straight to 1.1k in the hopes that we will be able to pick something up. And maybe cheap key and go for a couple of a thousand. I'm not too sure how profitable that'll be though we'll go for 1.1k for the most part with a lot of these so let's go 1.1k on this we're coming up to around the five minute mark here as well so i'm probably going to stop dropping as many bids on a lot of these because i don't want to be too cheeky and that's the thing with mass bidding if you do too many the price could change or if you do too many at the lowest price you'll get outbid on them all but i think i've got a decent mix with all of those right there so let's jump over here and go to a thousand coins and let's see if we can actually see anything at I'm just getting way too good. Let's see if we can see anything though at a thousand coins. I'm honestly not too sure. I was sniping him before and quite a few of this card was actually popping up, which is exactly what you want when you're looking for sniping filters on YouTube. You want active cards and every single player in this video is an active filter. It's one that you can go and use today. So it's not something that you have to wait for. It's instant coins, it's easy coins and it's a low budget method as well, which is going to take you from like 1,000 coins all the way up to 50,000 coins if you do this well enough. So I'm going to go through, see if I can see see one for a thousand coins so far we've not seen anything within 40 searches which it's not too bad it's not too bad I wish I've seen something though. And there we go. We've managed to get one at 1,000 coins. It didn't take me too long. I think I managed to get that within at least 100 searches. But I'm going to list this one up for 1.4k. Hopefully get an insta sell on. And let's just go back. How many did that tech us that time? Okay, so that was 90 searches just to find one at 1,000 coins. Which really isn't too bad. Honestly, isn't too bad. And hopefully we'll have win some on the transfer targets but we need to get into the last player and i don't want to big it up but honestly this is the best player that you are going to be sniping out of this video so let's get into it and that player is going to be zabaleta from west ham the right back this guy right now he's going for around 2.6k when i checked last he's actually come down a bit from when I was actually last sniping him. So he's going for around 2.5k right now. So he's probably insta selling at around 2.4, 2.5k on the PlayStation right now. So I'm going to do the exact same thing as what I did before. I'm going to put this to 1.9k because I want a mass bid at 2,000 coins. I'm probably going to drop one or two bids because there's not really any that are under the five minute mark so let's just go for 2,000 coins just on two of them see if that we can actually win anything jump back over here and set this to 2,000 coins and begin to snipe you know what actually i think i'm gonna go for 2.1k in the hopes that something will pop up time to go through though and show you guys how good this card is to snipe now this card is actually quite inflated so are all the right backs to be honest from the premier league right now like i said at the start so many people are going through and doing the league spcs right now because they've just not got anything else better to do so a lot of these player prices are actually going up and Zabaleta is someone who has actually gone up quite a bit in price so basically what you can do is go through and snipe him for a couple hundred coins under what he is actually going for like I said though please check whatever the price is when you guys come to do this and he will actually pop up quite a bit obviously as soon as I say that he won't start to pop up a lot but I want to go through and maybe get myself one or two snipes with this guy or at least show you guys some of the caliber deals that will actually pop up because one thing that you need to keep him one thing that you need to keep in mind when sniping these cards is that these are all common rare golds. So these could pop up for as low as 350 coins. So say, for example, one pops up at 350 and you snipe him at 350, you can insta sell him on at 2.4k and that's 2k profit just from sniping a Zabaleta. It's not hard. It's not hard to do whatsoever. It's easy coins and the 
good coins as well it's decent profit to be making on these individual cards so let's go through try and get ourselves a snipe hopefully it won't take me too much longer and let's get into it there we go <laughs> we've managed to get one at 2000 coins and we can insta sell him on at 2.4k honestly go out and try zabaleta out it may take you a bit longer than the other cards but the Profit potential on him is so much better than all of the other cards. I actually saw one at 550 coins and I completely messed it up. But as you can see, we've managed to sell him on. So what we need to do now though is jump over to our transfer targets and take a look at some of these cards to see if we've actually managed to win some. And taking a look right here, we have actually managed to win a few a few cards not bad, not bad. Some cards we've obviously missed out on which I can deal with. Some cards yeah, some cards we really, really have missed out on here, actually. And we've got these cards here who hopefully will come in pretty soon. But what I need to do is basically just chuck all these over to my transfer list. As you can see right here, I was actually doing some bidding before at 1,000 coins on this Johnny. And I did actually manage to get some. But we've got some at 1.2, 1.1. We've got some dunks at 1.1 as well. And another dunk as well, six. So we can chuck all these over to the transfer list. And I do want to see if any of my cards have actually sold on on the transfer list as well. But get all of these over there, which is very, very nice indeed. Some nice profit waiting for us. Got 23 items now on the transfer list. So let's jump straight over to see what's sold on. Everything's sold on, which is exactly what we want. And we've got... Some other cards in here as well, I'm pretty sure. Zabaleta was someone else I got before at 2,000 coins. Who else have we got in here? We've got a Doherty as well who I got at 1,000 coins. A Mustafi that I got for 900 coins. Some Johnnies at 1,000 coins. But as you can see right here, all of these cards are perfect, perfect to snipe. And let's just, you know what, let's just list this one up at 1.4k. Will it sell on straight away? Let's take a look. There we go. That's exactly what you want. There's nothing else I can really tell you guys. Go and do some sniping on these cards. I guarantee you guys that you'll be making some very, very nice profit. This one at 1.1. I can't even remember how much he was going for before. Let's just say he was going for 1.5. Hopefully he'll sell on. We've got a Mustafi there at 900 coins. I suppose I'll sell him on at 1.3k. Got a Doherty here at 1,000 coins, so I'll sell him at 1.4k. But like I said, let's go and try these methods out. You'll 110% be making yourself 50k in an hour by using all of these. That's sold on. Dunk, have you sold on? Hello, he's not sold on yet. Doherty though, 1.4k, he's not sold on yet. He will do soon, it's absolutely fine. But that is where I'm going to be wrapping up this video. If you are new to this channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button. It's just down here. Is it down here or down here? I'm not too sure. Click the bell next to it as well so you know as soon as I upload. Follow me on all my socials. There are links in the description. Go and watch some more videos. They will be popping up at the end. But this is six. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you have, drop a massive, massive like on it. But this is six, and I am off. Goodbye.